position the solid in the first quadrant. Look at the solid from the front to obtain the front view as shown in the figure. Look at the solid from the top to obtain the top view as shown in the figure. Rotate the horizontal plane 90 degrees clockwise to get the projection. Projections are obtained. Draw the line XY. Draw the projection of the cone when it is placed in simple position, that is, axis perpendicular to the HP and parallel to the VP, and name its corners. Rotate the front view so that the axis is inclined at 45 degrees to the XY line. Draw projectors from the rotated front view and the initial top view and name the points of intersection. Join the intersection point correspondingly to get the top view. Draw the locus of O1, O2 and locate the point M1 on the locus. Draw a line inclined at 30 degrees to the XY line through M1. With M1 as center and the height of cone 60 mm as radius, draw an arc to cut the inclined line at M2 and draw the locus of M2. With M1 as center and O1, O2 as radius, draw an arc to cut the locus of M2 at M3. Join M1, M3 which makes the apparent angle of inclination alpha as the XY line. Rotate the top view so that the axis of the cone O1, O2 rests on the line M1, M3. Note, M1, M2, the height of the cone is 60 mm. M1, M3, distance between O1 and O2 as shown in figure. Alpha, apparent inclination with the HP.